You look like something the cat declined to drag in. Congratulations! Uh, thank you, Zemat uh, Tomax. Uh, congratulations uh, for what? You will see. And here. In a moment. <laughs> congratulations, Mr. Harper. Or should I say, Mr. Mayor? You hold a commanding lead in the polls. You're a shoe in to be elected. <laughs> yes, and all these street gang attacks have brought the G.I. Joes to my side. They're protecting me. What? <laughs> G.I. Joe on the side of Cobra? How delicious. The world's greatest champions of law and order are behind. You, a law and order candidate. <laughs> Who could ask for anything more? <laughs> Why are we doing this? You know I'm not crazy about heights. We need to know why Cobra's mixed up in this election. Oh, these cords are never long enough. And I've got a hunch some of the answers may be up there. I'm not crazy about your hunches either. With you on our side, Mr. Harper, we can attain our goals by simply making them laws. This is worse than any hunch I had. Sounds like Cobra's financing Harper's campaign. Listen. But what about the street gangs? The street gangs are Cobra's pawns, Mr. Harper. <laughs> they think we really want Whittier Greenway to win. It makes their hatred of you more real, and their attacks on you have swung the voters over to your side. Simply arrest them once you take office. You'll be keeping your campaign promise. <laughs> the only way we can stop this is to tell the gangs what's going on. Uh, pardon us. We have some important business we must attend to. If we could just get one gang leader to listen to the truth and make him believe it. 